We're live. So we're early. Hopefully you guys got the memo. Let me repost the memo to the peoples. I did. Oh, you already posted to the people. Um, Jeff and I are going to an art show tonight, so we're going early today. Jeff is doing a pour really quickly with some unconventional colors. You know me and my weird color choices. Yes. What's up, y'all? Air hugs to everybody. I know, but we just started, so go lay down. Be good. Just be cute. Good job. This looks like caramel apple caramel. It does. Where's the light? We need to just mount a couple of these on the side of the table so we can be like, you know. I'll probably be able to see that better on Lucy. It literally makes me want a caramel apple. What up, Kim Rose? How you doing? How you been? How you mom and him? Also, tonight, I am going to do something potentially dumb. I know, I know. I know, I know. What is that? I'm going to pour on foam. Yeah. Will it work? Will it? don't work who knows who's to say but i know that spray paint eats up foam and i know heat will melt foam so i want to know if the heat that's put off by resin is enough to melt it but it's not conventional foam it's not like Foamy, I don't even know. It's like that stiff foam that you can put flowers in. I'll show you guys. Um, the art show is in Deep Ellum, I believe. No, it's not. It's at, where is it? Honestly, I don't remember. Is that some psychedelic robot or something? beyond I think it will be an interesting experiment Raphael that is amethyst it by... even smells like it like it really does I will check that makeup out what is up cat mermaid Absolutely, Sandy. I'm, I'm so sorry you went through all that, and I hope things are going well. I'm glad you got a funeral date and everything. Hell, artsy dude, I have no idea what that means. Is it high-density urethane foam? Let me read you what it says. It says, Floracraft foam, mousse, Espuma. Caution flammable. Don't expose open flame. So torches out. Um, made in the USA. Out of Ludington. It gives me zero information about what it actually is. but it was like a couple bucks at Michael's. Judy, what's up, Laura? Ow. So, I don't know, but it's like, sounds particle-y. Maybe it will melt. Are we taking bets? 
How many say will melt? How many say, meh, it'll be fine. I need to pick out some colors while Jeffrey is doing this. BRB. I think I'm gonna use some glitter. So far, it looks pretty fun. Hold on. Do we hold the light over it? Couple requests to do pours without stone coat, so here you go. Cells without stone coat. I think it's still a pretty pour. Hello, artsy dude. I'm saying font. That's my new YouTube channel. Oh my god. I'm saying font. Hello, artsy dude. Funny story. No, that's uh, it's surveillance. Oh, then you that's, already know. Yeah. <laughs> it's Tony. Anthony. My bad, Tony. This is fun. Like I'm, I'm not. It does look like you know what's crazy. It's painting. an illusion of to where this caramel it almost looks like a metallic because of the brown or the copper and the gold. I, I I had doubted your this color scheme at first. I thought you needed a lighter color, a blue maybe. But I think you made it work really well. Everybody seems to be liking it. Uh, what is Jeff using? I put it down in the description box, but I don't know if it posts yet. But I'll go ahead and tell you, he's using Amethyst by Artisu. Bright I'm gold. loving this. Um... Look how too. smooth it is. This is. These are the boards that we use for our kits and for our classes, by the way. Copper. So smooth. By Artisu. It's not going to focus. And Dark Caramel by Color Obsession. Y'all, this stuff actually looks like caramel. Cheryl, I like Stone Coat a lot, too. It looks great, Jeff. Well, I can't get whatever this is out of there. Now I'm just messing up the... It yep. feels like it's glass. Hmm. I don't know what that is. Thank you, Philly Phil. I'm not mad at it. I like it. It's great. Pretty. It's beautiful. Hi, Stephanie. Sorry we couldn't I be in it. your upcoming auction. She has an auction I told her we'd be a part of, but then I didn't realize that it was on my birthday. Oh, yeah. And I don't know what we're going to be doing. Because surprises. How did you seal it? The foam? Erica, you and Jeff are propagating lots of creativity in our world. I hope so. I hope people get inspired, entertained, and educated when they stop in to see what we're doing. Anyways, everybody should tune in to Stephanie's live auction. Um, I didn't steal it. It's straight out the box. Have a great night, Jen. Some people like caramel apples, not me. But I do have a candy apple in the fridge. <laughs> Hi, Moose. 
Y'all, we got a haircut today. I'll show you later. Lynn, this one is not the foam. I will be doing the foam one just as soon as he's done with this one. Come to New Zealand for your birthday. Melissa, I wish. One day. Yeah, Zori, we put it up in the, um, the Facebook group. It was a little last minute. Um, Raphael, the paper that we use is, honestly, it's like wax paper or shelf pa parchment paper that we just cut down into different size strips. I'm thinking about putting them on the website if there's a demand for it. Anybody could make these, but convenience. Some people just don't feel like it. Let me know if y'all are interested. Judy said $1.99 says it'll melt. I'm going to push the hype button even though you don't believe in me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you think that, uh, I didn't even think about that, the heat. Thanks, surveillance. <sighs> Love you, Judy. I, I've got to go pick out colors. All I picked out so far is glitter. I know I don't want to use a tint because I don't want the texture of the canvas to show through. So did we put the, uh, we didn't put, we need to make a peacock kit. Yeah. So we're putting peacock kit along with the ocean pour kits um, on the website for you guys. Um, what what are those? Twelve by twelves? Yeah. Yeah, twelve by twelves. Jellyfish. That doesn't look like jellyfish. I need a color. I need another color. Maybe. Maybe. That purple just glows underneath this light. Pretty fun, huh? Lynn, no, it's not an air gun. It's a, uh, a heat gun. Um, we do have them on the, uh, what do you call it? Description below? Yep. What about a kit for those awesome colors you used yesterday? Um, well, we're gonna do a custom color kit. Yeah, like we're gonna have drum. a couple different color. Like, we'll, we'll sell just the canvas and just the resin, and then you can add the whatever you guys you want. want. This is the pour from yesterday. All of the cells stayed, so super pumped about that. The turquoise, white, and gold. Blaine, if you got it all, then get to pouring. Believe in you. Jeff loved your skull pic that you posted. Oh, thanks. 
That was a while back. Aw, thanks, Kim. It's always fun. Zori, I have <clears throat> not finished the freeform table. I just have to apply the legs to it. Slacking. I'll do that this weekend, promise you. I think that, that brown gives up that little pop and then the purple next to it. That purple doesn't look very... Let me see the light. Where's the light at? Thank you, Paula. That purple should be pretty bouncy. Oh, shoot, it is. Yeah. It almost looks blue. That is a purple, y'all. Yeah. This is the one from yesterday. Thanks, y'all. No, the cells are something else. Um, Beyond, I haven't checked my Snapchat, and I will let Jeff know that you have a friend request out to him. Aw, oh, thanks, happy owl. So, I'm glad you left the middle alone. It's beautiful. Thanks, Mara. How are you? Erica, y'all need to have a full gallery show. We, we have a venue. I know, we just have to do it. And I was really pleased with how that one set up. I was worried it was gonna... You ordered that from me, Zachy Zoo? I'm glad you're here, Christy. Preparing. What up, Daphne? Zachy, so reach out to them. I'm sure they'll work with you. <clears throat> oh yeah, Misty sent me an email on it. This one from a couple days ago. So. Oh, good. I knew she would take care of it. Here, you're gonna get. So these are the colors I'm thinking about using. Chocolate. I think that's cherry. No, chocolate ruby red. Blue and 007. And of course, either white or black, this or that. always want to update when we're already live. 
The 007, what's up, Johnny? 007. I gave the name, by the way. Jeff okay. named it. Thank you. And it is from Color Obsession. However, it's not available yet. She gave me a sample, and I can't not use it. She also sent us with a silver that is also a leafing silver. That was a good looking pour, B. You did a good job. Amy. Yeah, I, I wish I would have done it on a bigger canvas. I just, I didn't know and I didn't really use a lot if it wasn't going to turn out right. So. I, know what I used. What did I use? Um, Hi, Jeff. Six ounces. <laughs> Yes, Color Obsession is who sent me the 007 Leafing Gold. I don't know when we're going to have 007 in our store. It all depends on when she gets it from the manufacturer. What had happened was is her paint supplier sent her this gold powder just to test to see if she would want it. And that happened while we were there, and we were like, uh, we want it, so you should want it also, too. And Jeff named it 007, and now it's in the works to get it here. What's up, Sam in Morocco? Morocco. Hi, baby. She's into Morocco's, Dino. Come here. Somebody name. Can I say hi to everybody movie. with their new haircut? Somebody name that movie I just <gasps> said. And this is not shut. This is why these. Are impossible to open. Why? There's a little spirit. Alright. I'm scared. We're gonna do this. See if anybody got the movie right. Oh. Yes, baby moves looking good. So, as I was talking about before, this board is just foam. I don't know if you see the texture of it. It's semi rough. It's a super dense foam though. So we're going to see how it works. The reason why I wanted to see if it was going to work is a few reasons. One, it's super light. So shipping wouldn't be near as expensive as if you used wood. Two, I can just carve out where I want to hang it because you know with something like this you don't want to just have a slot on the back so you can only hang it one way because what if you want to hang it a, like if what if it looks better like this than like this so yeah. never know so with this I'd be able to just slot out where I want it to be hung and I'm always down to experiment so let's do this is that person's name is hey I can do that <laughs> welcome, welcome. I, I take it this is your first time seeing us live. Look at Cujo. It's shut, bro. Sorry. Can't jump out the window today. He wouldn't. I'm scared. Too scared to give it any kind of, any possibility. So, you think that, you, you think that that's going to melt this? I don't think it will. I don't think so either. But... Almost everybody in the room said it's gonna melt. Judy put a dollar ninety nine on it and melting. Oh, so then if it doesn't melt, then you reverse those numbers. No, maybe. I'm just playing. I don't, th I don't think it'll melt. <clears throat> right. So we're gonna use my favorite resin, like I always do, because stone coat rules. 
Aren't Mary really and drool. Blackburn. Hey, y'all. Heat on styrofoam. Yep. I'm doing it. This is a pretty... Well, it's that is. It's fairly yeah. dense. I'm not going to torch it. and I'm not going to, like, Spray heat. paint will heat that up. I know that. I'm going to find out with all y'all how styrofoam do. Moody do. I'm wondering about Lisa air. Art. I'm sending something for, uh-oh, I need some red. Somebody's sending something for Pujo's. The Moo Gallery? Gallery. <clears throat> I don't think I'm gonna close admittance to that. I think I'm just gonna put up everything I have and if people wanna add to it, then word. Sniffles, y'all. Sniffles. So I'm starting out with eight ounces. We'll see if that is adequate enough or new. Paint will melt it. Heat gun, this will be fun. Like, will it need to be sealed like the wood? I don't know. We're going to find out. There could be lots of bubbles. Chemical e-science. Basically. I don't know, Ellen. It's just foam foam. It's foam that you make wreaths out of. Yeah, like put flowers in it. It's not It's not as soft as the flower, the green stuff that you can like poke your finger in. This is more, this is a little bit more rigid. Um, there is a texture on it though. Yeah, there is a texture and I think it'll definitely, it'll seep into that, so. It may be a two-coater, but well, that'll still be lighter than wood. We'll see. I've got blue fingers. Hello, Missy Gold. It. Well, just imagine if it works. Well, this how much was that? That was like seven dollars. It was like seven dollars, but <laughs> that's not very cheap for a piece of foam. Yeah, but it was at Michael's. I'm sure I could find it online for way cheaper. We just went ahead and bought this so that we could do a practical test. So make sure you tune in tomorrow to see how it's set up. Shelly, that's what she said. Where to buy the MDF boards? Um, you can get it at Home Depot. Those aren't in, well, the big sheets of it are, but not the, the rounds that we end up using. Oh, hey, Missy, thank you. Thank you, Missy. Where do you buy the, oh. So I'm using chocolate, blue, ruby, Gold. Yeah, Tiff, that's where we got our our rounds. Um, I think we got like a 16 inch and then like a 24. And then with the biggest I think we got was like a 48. That's what we have on our ottoman. I really want to redo the ottoman one or just keep adding glitter to it. Well, welcome back, Christina. It's always high end. <laughs> Hello, Lisa Ham. We've tried to do it on, on one of these, like just poured resin on it. You could see there's bubbles, like it's going into it. I don't know if that's from me mixing it. Hold on, let's see. Mm. 
You know what would be really smart is to actually mix up a little bit more resin just to make sure that I keep as much heat off of it as possible. Maybe you should heat it and then blow dry it like we... I'm gonna, I'm gonna make this a little closer to them. Okay, I just want them to be able to see the whole thing. So I'm just making another four ounces. I wonder why that's so dark. Let's do this. When we grow up and have a dedicated room for our filming studio, we're not gonna have any windows in it. Hello, Julie, how are you? Yeah, Missy, we just we're just experimenting today. We're just seeing what what it'll do. If we just put straight resin on here and put a little heat on it. We'll see. Well until then, let's I'll give you guys a more wider angle view. We have another argument outside today. Thanks, Anna. I appreciate it. Hi, Doris. How are you? Julie, we love to, to test stuff out. Um, that's that's basically why we started this channel. Um, we get a lot of a, a lot of flack for how we do stuff, um, how our stuff doesn't look finished, or we don't do the sides or the bottom, or um, and half the time it's not even finished. Like the piece isn't finished, or we just didn't like it, so we paint over it. So that's why it looks like the edges aren't done or the bottom isn't finished. Um, this channel is for to show you guys what what works and what doesn't work for us. And this is what we love doing, you know. We decided to not go on Patreon. We decided not to charge. We decided not to, you know. So this is what we love to do. And it's, it's not even work for us, you know? It's fun, we love to do this. So this is what works for us. This is not how you're supposed to do it. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't, so. All we can show you is what we know. And then it's up to you guys to apply it however you want to. This is that ruby red, that's a little dark. Sorry. Still a little dark. Maybe on this camera. Oh, that's dripping. That looks good on that camera. And then the chocolate, which Jeff just used in his last piece. What's so funny, I put the light on it and it gets dark. This literally looks like milk chocolate. It does. I cannot wait. These are the kind of light bulbs I want in, in, in my lights up there. I'm a 
obsessed. <laughs> well, thank you, Julie. Julie Ann Anderson says, Erica, you need to read my email and see a little secret I put in the coasters. Oh, absolutely, Julie. Will you write her name down so I don't... Hi, Mallory. ...miss it. Awesome. Thank you, Paula. You've written on almost all this. Julie. Anderson, email. I get my clients with anxiety to watch this channel and they love it. That's so awesome. Except for when I get anxiety and stress out, then they're like, I can't take it. <laughs> Flip a table. If it leaks a little bit, like if there's like little low spots in this, like because it's not solid and it kind of bleeds into it a little bit, but it doesn't like start to melt or anything like that. I will do a second coat on this tomorrow and see if it turns into a perfect circle, like surface. Why did I fill this so full? Nobody knows. Beyonce said, I'm eating birthday cake out of a mug because college life and nobody washes their dishes out here. Well, it sounds like you don't wash your dishes <laughs> unless you're wanting somebody to wash your dishes for you. Sounds like a choice to me. <laughs> That's just college though. Gotta adapt to not the best roommate sometimes. I know, what if this thing, this whole thing just started smoking? Then lesson learned, abort, abort, abort. What blue are you using? Oh, I decided to go away from... Oh, no, I didn't. I'm using the... Oh, color Bondi. obsession. Bondi blue. I called it billionaire blue for some reason the other day. Bondi blue? Or B Bondi? 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 B-O-N-A. Oh, Bonaire. Uh, Bonaire. Sorry, not Bondi. We have a Bondi blue. <laughs> okay, I'm back with Dove's chocolate bar right out of the fridge. That sounds amazing. There you go. Boner blue. Aaron, I don't, I don't, uh, pretty sure that's not what it's called. Maybe, okay, yeah, no. Maybe. Yeah. For sure. Maybe after nine o'clock. ATD after dark, probably. So many bobbles, I just want to hit it with a heat gun. Maybe a torch would be better if you just, whoosh, mm -mm. just right over it. So you're not putting that much heat on it. Mm -mm. It's so funny because I really don't want it to melt, but I, I'm glad we're doing this live so they can see it actually happen if it does. Gosh, sorry, but are you putting acrylic paint in resin? Lynn, it's not acrylic paint. This is all pigments. Um, designed for resin. Designed for resin. You can um, use. You can use acrylic paints if you like. Um, they're not as opaque and vibrant and um, and 
if you put too much in your resin, if you put too much acrylic paint in your resin, it will definitely affect the chemistry and it will turn into marshmallow fluff. Um, Technical but these are all pigments designed uh, for resin. There's pastes, there's powders, um, there's tints, liquid tints that we sell on our website, artistelldeath.com. Um, and they're all made for this. Mmm, marshmallow fluff. Right? All right, y'all don't judge me on this yet. I'll use acrylic. Yeah, you can use it. You can use acrylic paint all day long. That's what, that's what we used to do as well. Alright, I'm not going to put too much heat on this because I don't want it to extra do something crazy, so I'm just going to be a swiper. It's going to be a swiping June bug. What does that mean? No torch. Marshmallow fresh. Well, I guess it depends on what it comes in. That's what she said. <laughs> Whoa, that was almost like a rainbow mm -hmm. when I first looked over. Um, because they have marshmallow fluff, which is already puffed out for probably like it's probably better to use that for rice crispy treats. Maybe it's so funny. All these bubbles, you can just see them like coming up from the uh, styrofoam. Okay, it might just be cells. I'm looking for a mini. I'm so hungry now. <laughs> it'll work. That'll, that'll happen. You got your new shoes on. Without, you have all clothes on that you shouldn't be getting resin on. That looks fun. Do you want a bib? That's what bibs are for. Oh my gosh, she drives me crazy and she doesn't cover up her clothes. Just got a bunch of ink and paste and powders in the mail today. Well. I'm happy to say that you're gonna love them and your acrylics are definitely going to be a little jealous. Look out, Moop. Look out, Moopert. Look out, just for a minute. And it looks so smooth and you pop the bubbles in there and then they you think it would just seep into there and then... The thing is, it's not like even almost coming through on the bottom side. No, it won't go all the way through. Now I'm just interested in overnight. Mm -hmm. That's so much fun. I don't, I don't like this chocolate in here. Yeah, but that looks so good though. It looks good with the gold and the brown or the blue. That's what, I love that. It looks good. And you would never even know it was on styrofoam unless you saw it at an angle. Let's see, I'll show you guys what it looks like when... Can you kind of see the bubbles? You can see in there. Like right when she hits it with the uh, heat gun, they all just come back. Definitely alters the surface tension Alter. for these cells. And they shouldn't be this loose. Suck it up, it's beautiful. 
Yeah, that's one thing that that really looks even worse on the side or the uh that looks worse is the sides. Like it's really rough looking. It's not like a smooth overlay. <laughs> but this is just a test. Yeah. And if this looks fine, then the idea would be to just do like a quick coat. But I wonder if those bubbles will go away before you. Mm -hmm. Like, you'll be able to see those bubbles when you do a clear coat over it, right? They'll be like noticeable. So what I'm saying is do a quick coat over the styrofoam just to get these little, because that's what the quick coat is for, is to fill in things. Disintegrate. You said with time it will disintegrate. Huh? Styrofoam, with time it will disintegrate. Then you'd have an awesome shell. Yeah, it'd be awesome. They could just hang it. Use torch. I don't want to kill it. Yeah, you could, you could probably put tape around the edges, but then you would just take off styrofoam when you took it off and it would be chunky mm -hmm. I would think I think this is a good test for the time being you can definitely see yeah you can use if if we could get gator board show them Lucy that would be I just want to see I want them to see the bubbles pop when I'm Put heat over it. Oh, hold on. Let's see. Okay, let's try now. Yeah, I can see it. So here are the two things that I would use to remedy this. One, seal it with a polycrylic, because why not? We have two more foam boards that we're gonna try um, to pour on and see what happens. So far, nothing looks melty, but it hasn't really gotten that hot yet either, so. What a hero. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> Look at the smiley face. Oh. Hey, hey kids. That's creeping. Mod podge, yeah. Because I did water some down. What did I put that on? I put it on the back of a canvas, and it and it uh, it made the canvas um, pretty stiff. Mm -hmm. Creepy Jeff. <laughs> well, I didn't make it. Handy dandy sticks, clean them off as soon as you're done with them, or use them the next day. Boom, environment. say where this where that party is it's a party or it's an art show oh, psychedelic robot let's see what time crescent court these colors together this light blue this bon air 
It always makes things look like it's glowing. Oh man. Look at that. What is it? The Bonaire. Oh yeah. Well, anything, any, like any of those, oh, there, it's an almost transparent paste that Color Obsession makes. Um, it just pops everything. And that's what looks good next to a metallic is those popping colors. Yeah, smash that button like your mama told you to. Your mama? Oh, it's off of uh, over in the arts district. Oh yeah, I said I was gonna use glitter. I'll put glitter in this piece. One of these co-stars. We're not missing anything, are we? They're talking amongst each other. Thanks, Lisa. That's such a great color. I know, I haven't put any more res, I mean, I've added resin to it and it's just faded out. Just say what time it starts. The last event you wanted to go to it started at like some weird time in the afternoon. Hey, can you apply heat? to ink and resin. Yep. You sure can. Um, Daphne's paint studio. every bit of this. Sorry y'all if it's getting bowring. Alright, where's my glitter? Can't. That's a lot of cabinets, Lisa. This glitter is So did the phone work okay? Crazy. You go buy a lotto ticket. Oh yeah, we have a lotto ticket. I went and got five of them. Whoa. You're welcome there, surveillance. I would say that it did work okay. The foam did breathe a little bit, so we'll have to see how it sets up, but it did not melt as far as I know so far. Can't do it. When you put glitter and resin, you have to use a lot of glitter for it to even matter. But it, Judy, I think that it'll be fine because it's not contained in one bucket. Like if you put a bunch of resin in a bucket and then put a piece of styrofoam in there it might eat it up but since it's spread out evenly in a little thin layer i don't i don't i, I don't see it um i could be wrong though you could be right i, I just don't I, I don't know we'll find out in the morning doris i just might have to do that and if I won the lottery, just imagine 
what we would be doing. Like, <laughs> we would still art. We would. Well, that's what I'm saying. Like, we would be doing flying people classes to France and looking at, you know, some awesome art over there and Rome and Italy and Greece and taking everybody out for a cruise. <laughs> Typing with my big toe tonight. Oh. Lisa, we're, we're, we would like to try to do that. Try to um, set up a cruise. Not necessarily through the cruise line, but just if you want to go on a cruise, then we'll be on this cruise and... Um, get together and paint. Get together and do some pours. We can... We could... We could do that. People have groups on their cruises all the time that have nothing to do with the cruise lines. Give me that money. And you know how many people would want to attend that? I mean, people that are even on the cruise would want to because it would be such a fun new thing. Hey, look at this. Doris wants to know if you had a chance to look at your email, her email. Oh, wow, that's so amazing. You guys, look at that. It looks like a unicorn took a squat on it. Hey. Count me in. Because who doesn't like glitter? Who? Unicorn snot. There you go. If you like this glitter, I have it listed in our Amazon link down in the description box below. Now I want to do a big one with these colors. The ruby, gold, bonaire, and glitter. Was that fairy dust? No, it was the, uh, it's the ultimate, the ultra sparkle glitter. Like the stuff that does not come off of anything, off of your body, off of your clothes, off of your oh, facial wow. hair. <laughs> Who asked if I saw their email? Did you write their name down? Uh, Doris. I will find it and I will read it. Craft herpes, yep. That is definitely craft herpes. So y'all, I hope you enjoyed our experiment. We'll know tomorrow if it works or not. Wanna well, come here and say hi to everybody? Come here. Also, I got my uh, door to work kind of halfway. Come here. It works. Oh, I got him. I got him. Ellen, I will get someone on a deep red for you. The ruby is pretty deep. And the cherry has been reinstated. So, as soon as that comes back in, I'll review it. I have it on order. Thank you, Lisa. Anyways, Moo really wants to go pee on stuff. He's looking at me like, are you still talking right now? Are you still talking right now? Okay, baby kids. Thank you. Anyways, hope you guys learned something. What to do, what not to do. We're entertained, educated in some way, and are now informed. Street educated. And it's because I'm from the street. Dougiest one. It's cute. Oh, it's our pleasure, Missy. Um, oh, the challenge. I'm so sorry. I have no excuse. I lifed today and instead um, of narrowing that down. I have my top 20. I will post that on Facebook and announce tomorrow. Because I messed up, I'll have two winners for you guys. So I'm, I got nothing. I'm gonna make a note. 
Ocean Pour winner announcement. Um, also, the October challenge will be for breast cancer awareness. Do something pink. I will puppy sit move for you forever. You'd return him, pretty sure. Anyways, you guys, read all this stuff, read all about it, and we'll see you guys here, same time, same place, manana. And I promise I'll have both of the winners, and we'll do a drawing for the honorable mentions. Come on. Oh, what a big jumper. What a big jumper. So we'll, get some, Thank you. we'll get, some, we'll get okay. a couple winners some stickers, too. Yeah. All right, you guys. We love you forever, and um, we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. I said bye.